Hey guys, um, I figured I'd make a video since I already made one on Grizzly Dark Wintergreen, which I just got a new can of. I figured I'd make one on regular Grizzly Wintergreen because I, I hadn't had the regular Grizzly Wintergreen before I tried the Dark Wintergreen, so I'm doing that. And I've already tried this, and I honestly think there's quite a bit of difference. But just the fact, I think the dark has a stronger taste, I guess. Like, it's more, like, more noticeable. I feel like this is, like, a little weaker, I guess. I don't know. And then, um, after I do this, I'm going to eventually get a can of Copenhagen wintergreen so I can see the difference between like Copenhagen and Grizzly and all the different winter greens and see how that goes and then somebody told me to do Longhorn straight okay I love straights like uh, Copenhagen straight is one of my favorite dips I hate Longhorn <laughs> I mean I'll do anything you guys request but I absolutely just I did not like the Longhorn at all and I mean I guess I could do it but it's kind of annoying because like I haven't finished that Longhorn mint yet and like I know it's cheap but I don't want to waste my money on dip that I'm not gonna do but I guess I can maybe do that I'll have to think about it oh I got the side of my head shaved too and I got it colored and stuff it's the first time I've got my hair professionally done in about almost five years last time I had my hair professionally done was eighth grade and I'm going into twelfth grade four about four years eight nine four to five years it's going on five years so yeah I just want to try something new and yeah so I'm doing that All right. I, I need to clean out my mojo again, so I'm using a bottle again. Okay. Oh, that was slick. I got it. Okay. Grizzly winter green. Okay. I went to a fair and like around where I live. And there were these two guys working in this one stand for like this game where you can win the goldfish. And they were, I would say they're in their like 20s. It's kind of weird. And the one guy's like, Oh, you dip? Because I had my can in my back pocket. And I was like, Yeah. And he's like, No. -uh. I was like, Yup. And then he asked me what kind. And I was like, Well, right now, Copenhagen Long Cut Original. And then he's like, oh, you need some of this. And he pulled out Grizzly Dark Wintergreen. And, yeah. And then the other guy's like, oh, you dip? And I'm like, yeah. He's like, no, I'll put one in. So I had to put one in. It's really weird. And he gave me a high five. Thanks, guys. My gums are starting to get sore on my left side. Oh, I'm making a mess now. Alright. I 
I wonder if there's a difference in like the smells. Of course, I need to crack this can. I forgot. I thought I cracked it last night. I don't know. I don't know if this is just for me, but this part of the barcode is the hardest part to get past. Freaking barcodes, man. But, so, I'm going to see these smell a lot different, or just a little different, or not at all different. Yeah, I'm really surprised, like, I'm not a wintergreen person. But I'm like hooked on Grizzly Wintergreen now. Like, it's so good. And when I started dipping, I could not do Wintergreen at all. Like, I only ever tried one can of Wintergreen. I think I, I think I did some Wintergreen pouches, but I don't remember. Okay, this is the dark. I didn't really pack that, but that's the regular. I think this one just like, this doesn't even really smell like wintergreen. My other can of dark really, really had a strong smell. Like this one, I mean really, at first the smells are strong, but like after you get used to them, like, they don't smell that strong. I think... If I remember correctly, it just got really dark in here. I remember, oh, there we go. If I remember correctly, I think Copenhagen has a really strong wintergreen smell, where this isn't the regular wintergreen for Grizzly. It's not like super strong, but it's kind of strong, you know? Then the dark wintergreen just kind of, I think the smell isn't as strong. But I think I'm getting sick, so I can't really smell things that well. So I might have to change my mind on that when I can actually smell. I have a really small dip in. I've been doing like really small dips because, like, well, now my mom should be home like every night so I can get dip more often. But she got me. I have a lot left of regular wintergreen. I have like maybe half a pinch or pinch left of long cut and then I have full can of dark winter green so that should last me a while if I take small dips because usually I go through now I almost go through a can a day <laughs> and my mom's starting to get really mad even though I pay for it like usually she only gets me a dip when she goes to get cigarettes so yep so I think that's about it for this uh, video so, um, Grizzly Wintergreen is good, and I'm hooked on Grizzly Wintergreen, like, the dark and regular Wintergreen right now. I don't know why. I feel like every time I try a new dip, I just love it, and I can't stop doing it. Like, I have so many straight, I have so many, like, uh, long cuts, and then, now I have three Grizzly cans. I have, like, 38 cans in my dip tower now, so I'm getting up there. So, I'm, uh pretty proud of that um yeah so you guys can request more dip um longhorns I'm not a huge fan they're really dry and they don't pack very well all oh, these pack grizzly packs really good like really good like you can get a good pinch with grizzly and it, like it stays together really well so that's one thing I like about grizzly and like Copenhagen, you can, that packs, like, pretty good. Skull packs okay. Longhorn doesn't pack worth shit. So, yeah. So if you guys want to request more dip for me to do, I can do that. And we should have it. I think I'm going to do a video on Redman, like, and then I'm going to see if I can't get some Levi Garrett. Because I really, really... I want Chew really bad. Like, I had Redman once and I loved it. And 
So, let's see if I can't get some red man. I don't know how much that is here. I don't think it's not too much. I think it's like. In New York, I know it's like more expensive, but I get it in Pennsylvania, so I think it's like. I want to say six or seven dollars, maybe. So I'll try and get some of that for you guys. So I hope you liked this video. And if you have any more requests for dip, let me know.